Look, Cyberpunk 2077 looks good and fun and all, and I could totally sing I could totally see it being like the new Borderlands slash Bioshock. However, I have heard that in the Cyberpunk universe, because of the tech, there are body mods that let you be Anthro. So if 2077 doesn't let me be a bad, so, so if 2077 doesn't let me be Batty Boy. Then I'm just not fully sold. Sorry, Keanu. You're breathtaking, but you're not going to sell me on 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 a potentially like eighty dollar game. I mean, I'll probably play it eventually either way, because hell, they're probably by, by the like you know as soon as it comes out, there's going to be mods out the ass. I hope at least, and I hope the mods are good. Let's see. Yeah, put up scrap bottles for. Um, no, don't eat the pills. We don't need to. Why do I still have my nails? Boy, I need to pay attention. That's it. That's wasted inventory space. Okay, I don't need the staff, but... Meh. Wait a second. Do staff stack? No, they do not. So I'm gonna go put this somewhere. Jeez, Zeus, chill. Oh. I sure hope I can I can fix my my uh, shovel. I can. Sweet. Okay. Note to self. Shovels take a lot of damage against doors. Southwest, is that... what is... I, I, can't, I couldn't tell what that was. With a dog it can fuck off of its... with it a savage it can fuck off too. Hmm. You know... I don't know. Like, I just feel like they have the potential to, to do a lot of really cool stuff with Cyberpunk, but I doubt they're going to... I doubt they're going to. There's so much cool stuff that they could do. Like, like, as much as, as much as it was a meme, like, I feel like if, the, if they really do let you customize your genitals in, in, uh, in 2077, I feel like, A, that's gonna be an adult-only game, <laughs> B, I mean, that just, I mean, that's, that, that's, like, the first game to ever do that. <laughs> I almost stepped on a bear trap, but hey, scrap metal. I'm not kidding. That 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 would be pretty cool. Like, I mean, it would probably add nothing to the gameplay, but you know. Unless there's sex in the game, which I doubt there there's going to be. It looks like just like a, you know, oh, you got this open world and it's and it's uh and like all these factions and you and you got to and you got to fucking consider your reputation and and 
how and and how much power each of these factions has over like the places in the in the city and like make sure no one faction is too powerful or I don't fucking know I don't know the story like the game isn't even fucking out I'm just saying there's so much potential there is there is so much potential for Cyberpunk 2077, but I don't know. I'm just not. I'm just not fully convinced. Like, yeah. Oh, you you get a sword that comes out of your arm. Oh gosh, that's that's such a cool original idea. Yeah, I'll poke fun, but you know. I just want it to do something... Am I being too... critical? I guess? I don't know if I am, it's just... I really want 2077 to do something amazing, okay? Because this game has been in how, how much production for how long now? This game has been hyped up to hell and back. As just, as just going to... going to be just something... Like, out of this world, ooh, yes, yes, and yes. But I really don't think it's going to be. I think it's going to be good, like, really, really good, but I don't think it's going to be as god-tier as... Good, 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 good. Okay, Faco, you want to be like that? Is there a bear trap here? Heck. There was! Okay. Good, good, good. Okay. Everything. Maybe I just need to go to the church or the church ruins. It's just the matter that I need more convincing on 2077. <sighs> Shut the fuck up, dogs. You know? I don't intend to be hypercritical, I'm just like... You know? It, it's one of those things where it just has so much potential, and I don't want it to go to waste, you know? But like I said, the mods are probably going to are probably going to do a lot for it. You know there's going to be just countless mods for the game right out the gate. I really am hoping for quality. Ooh. Ooh. My batteries. My watch. Tracks again. Boy, I sure do wish that these tracks were on the map. Oh, 
Chocolates and mushrooms. It's somewhere around here. Poison mushrooms. Didn't mean to do that. There's my stuff. as it should be. Good, good, good. How about you don't? How about for for just today, for or at least for the next couple minutes, how about we don't? You good? Okay. That's a search, but it's already been searched. And this is an open, I assume? Yep. What the? I mean, okay. Three, five, four, three. Thank you. And kiss them for me. What? Okay, I can go in here, but I'm not going to go in here yet. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get to my other hideout and manage some stuff. And then I'll come back here and do that. Is it is it unfair to hold is it unfair to hold a game to a certain to expectations? I don't know. Honestly, expectations are kind of a hazard. Mainly just to yourself. Did I let this run out of it? Do I even have gas? I think I may not have gasoline, unless I got that tank of gas from from the road and put it in here. Please let there be gas here. I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. Oh god, I'm so screwed. Screwed. Yeah, I think I think at some point expectations are just kind of are, are hazardous to your own enjoyment of a thing. Like you like you expect you expect the, you expect this something to just just be just be the new big awesome wonderful thing. Why do I have so much gas in my second hideout and none in my third? Oh. God, I. I just been asking to get screwed like this. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh, this is the worst thing that could happen. Unless I get lucky and just... Oh. Okay. Unless I get lucky and like somewhere over here is just an open crate 
or a corpse that has that has some gasoline. Oh god, I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. Why didn't I grab a tank of gas? Oh gosh, golly good gosh, Jim, Jimmy Johnson. I wish I had... I'm just, I just have to accept my death. I'm sure there might be some gasoline. I'm sure there might be some gasoline somewhere at the church, but... Might be... will not help me survive the night. I'm going to die. And I'm going to die pitifully and stupidly. As I deserve. So here's what I'm going to do. How long do these flares last? Last time I saw a flare light up, it stayed lit for a good while. I don't like any of these noises. This is the most- I think this is the most helpless I've ever felt in this game. I'm not going to survive the night. Jesus, what the fuck is happening out there? Like, whatever's out there is intent on destroying everything I have. Oh no! Please! 
Is that bird friend? Oh, I'm not prepared for bird friend. What is that? What is that? Can I attack it? No, it's just, it just hurts me. Okay. You want some of this, fuck boy? Come at me. I may be screwed, but I'm not going down without a fight. Fuck you, dog. Thirty minutes from survival and dogs come in. <sighs> Had to be dogs. I, I, I'm, I'm honestly, honestly, I'm surprised I lasted that long. <sighs> Hold on, traitor. If I, I could have, I could have. I was that close to surviving. You're getting your ass a shiny ass stone. I'm surprised how well the flares worked. Fucking believe this. How much did they break? Okay, these doors seem good. This door seems good. Thought I barricaded that. This trap was set off. Both of these doors and barricades are broken. Of course. Both of them. It had to be both of them. Ugh, hostile. I don't know what that cloud was. Was it the dark cloud? The 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 an the antagonist of uh, of of um Final Fantasy three. I think that's correct.
this needs fucking juiced. And I can guarantee you, at some point, I probably refilled this, then left then left it on, and someone was screaming at me. Trust me, I'd be screaming at me too. You know what, Trader Man, you're getting another shiny ass stone. Cause I need cause I need boards. And I think I should have I do. more than anything I still haven't checked if the flares work for ghosts <sighs> I tried the flashlight and it didn't really help where's I, I know there was another one in here there we go trade I'd say really but we'll we'll survive again and we'll deal no it's not Silent Hill that this music reminds me of it's Resident Evil it reminds me of Resident Evil save room themes, which is very, which is, it works. I don't know what that pop was. It did not sound pleasant. It came from my chair, and that's that's not good. broken doors. Because there was a lot of commotion last night. Those fucking stupid dogs. I don't even know how... Okay. Here's a door that needs fixed. I need my nails! Why did they break this door only to not go through it and not try to break the... Whatever, man. Needs another bear trap, which I have one. I have two. The good thing about these bear traps is they one shot dogs. But 
But yeah, to, fi to finish up my thoughts on 2077, it's just a matter that I may have to, I may have, I may have high expectations. And the end. And while that that probably isn't fair to the game, that's just how it goes. That's just how it goes with with any game, really. It looks really good. I, I'm not going to deny that. I just think that there's a lot of ways that it could be great, and there's a lot of ways that it could probably be not great. And I just want it to be great, you know? Because it looks like it's got this huge, huge open world, and it could do so much... End up spending sixty, thirty, ninety, uh, eh, whatever. May not even use this hideout tonight. Not sure. We'll see what happens. But by that time, I don't. And we'll probably come across some more. We'll probably come across some more uh, gasoline. Okay, are we good? Are we good to go in there? Maybe. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go ahead. It's surprising that we survived that night longer than I anticipated. Not still. That was the Chompy Boy Armada. See what what's down hole number one. Wait, you can disarm these? I would have known that. Jeez, this place is a minefield. Pills. Oh, I should have. I, I really should have bought some more. Some more 9 volts. Was that. Oh, drums. I'll get them on the way out, maybe. Hopefully. Twisted key? Ooh, I shouldn't have done that! Ooh, I sh Ooh, shouldn't have done that! Don't do it! 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 My watch!
course you do realize this means war. There's like four chompy boys down there. And they got my shit. Wait a second. The twisted key. The twisted key might actually be what I'm looking for. But I need my stuff back. But then where do I find the wolf? on the shovel oh fucking course <laughs> god damn it I'm just gonna be pursued by this dog until it kills me You know, I'm not really a dog person. Like, I like animals. But, but, I'm more, I'm more of a cat person. Hell, I'm more of a ferret person. But if, if, if any reason to not, to dislike dogs, this game is one of them. Oh, for the love of God. Okay, we're gonna go down there, ignite the Chompy Boys, and get our stuff back. Simple as that. I could just leave. I have the twisted key, and I'm pretty sure that's what I need. The only issue is... Where's the wolf? Scottish resistance. Wow! No, I can't leave this. Everything I have and hold dear is down there. My watch, my batteries, Well, I have my pills, surprisingly. I need my stuff. The generator isn't on, is it? Okay, good. Would have fucking eviscerated myself. Okay, how long does the well water last? 
not very long. So you know what we're gonna do? Gonna pop some stamina pills when we get in there. And see if we can't huck it with the with the left left bumper. You prepared for the kind of death you've de Are you prepared for the kind of death you deserve, little man? Or is it or, or is it the kind of death you've earned? I think it's the kind of death you've earned. What the One of them is literally right there. Thank God for invulnerability. Thank God for iframes. Son of a... stuff no. <sighs> this is going to be the biggest hassle I just want my shit back that's all I want Fucking wasted my Molotov. Don't think I'm not pissed about that. I thought there it just out of just out of the thought that the that the first three times I tried to get in there, there was an asshole right there at the door. I was thinking that hey, down that hall must be that asshole. But hey, I think right now the formula we're gonna have to work out is get is get is grabbing the shit, r try trying to charge the door, dying. But hey, at least the shit will be closer to the door. And hey, as long as I still have my stamina pills, which I probably don't. <laughs> <laughs> of course I don't! Okay, right bu right bumper... Tr X, X, X. Right bumper, X, X, X. You motherfuckers! I hate this. I genuinely hate this. I am not leaving without my stuff! Ow. You know what? When the going gets tough, get a fucking gun. Why do I? Why does? Why does it have to lead me to rage every every, every session?
I just want to get my shit. That's all I fucking want. That's all I want. I just want my shit back. I came in. I got the thing that I needed. I, t I touched the wrong th I, I accidentally touched the wrong thing, and there awakens four of those assholes. And there's a fucking dog. There's a fucking dog over there, and if it comes for me, I'm gonna fucking scream. This thing has spread. It's a shotgun. Okay, they're they're screamed. There's four of them. There's four of them. There is four of them. Okay, that was, we got, we got one of them. I was hoping that the spread on the shotgun would be better, because somehow it only got one of them in that entire, in fact there were five of them. And now there's two fucking dogs over there, I'm going to fucking flip my shit. Now the shotgun's really effective for these assholes. Proven that the shotgun can be repaired. Note to self keep the fucking shotgun. I will quote, I will quote Farnsworth yet again Who needs courage when you have a gun? Wolf, please find me, my friend. Oh, we got two odd meats. That's pretty good. Oh, we can't. We can't repair the shotgun. Can we upgrade the shotgun? We can't. Well, that's cool. Okay, I guess we're just not taking any more journal entries. 
Should I should I just stay here for now? Yeah. May as well get ready for the night. That was a hassle. I rather would have rather not dealt with a bunch of assholes. Five chompers. I, I don't appreciate that. One bit. Okay, bear trap still there. I'm pretty sure I don't have the resources. Pretty sure I don't have the resources to barricade any of the doors at the moment. I have nothing at this at this place. And it actively try and it actively does its best to screw me. Okay, I don't come through this through this direction very often, so one in front of the window. Well, I just need one in front of the window. Mm, get it. And get it, get it, get it, get it. Right there. That one goes there. And I think I can make one more? Yeah. Fuckos. <sighs> this is your conductor speaking. F on the fuck train express. Okay. You know I've been called a simp once for for complimenting someone's art. You know, I think like okay, yeah, I get it. A, a, a simps are the you know the people who just, who waste the, waste all their money th on the fantasy that 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 cam girl with the big titties actually th actually thinks that they're going to be in a relationship with them. And then, then cancels them when they're not. But like, like simp really is just the just the new. I don't I don't agree with you liking something. Word. It's the I'm going to attack you for liking something that I don't word. And that's how words lose all meaning. You know. Yeah, it's it's frustrating. I I I genuinely hate it. Uh, 
It's ju it's just another way to spread negativity. That's all it is. And yeah, people people like actual simp's. Maybe they need maybe they need to talk to someone rather than spending all their money on that cam girl that doesn't actually think of them as you know potential romance candidate like that like their fantasies wish they would but when it gets to the point where 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 people can't spread positivity because oh it's a f fucking simp i use my word therefore uh, your 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 enjoyment of something is invalidated oh no the ghosts what the what the hell is this Oh. Um. Oh no. I have a feeling I know who's gonna show up. Where is he? There he is! Uh, I don't know how to deal with bird friend. Oh god. Oh god. I genuinely don't know how to deal with this guy. What do I do? Do I just let him be? Okay, I'm not gonna deal with you, bird friend. What the? <gasps> Shrums! Okay, y y th this room is just yours now. Okay, I I'm, I'm fine with that. I think Bird Friend is just an obstacle. But, uh, as I was saying, yeah, simp has become just a word for I don't agree with your opinion and wish to insult you. Uh, bird friend, please leave. I didn't invite you. Didn't invite you over. So, I'd appreciate if you left. Get in the get in the trap. Oh, he's already in the trap. I don't think I have the... I don't think I have the resources to fix that. Oh, this is bad. comes to like you can't enjoy some something because someone uses th their their big word their big mean word on you then I don't think I don't think it's I don't think it's necessary to have that word give me your meat We even dealt with we even dealt with having bird friend around. 
Now that's a successful night. What's broken? What needs fixing? Let's turn this off. Probably need to get more gas. In fact, I'll probably buy gas. Okay, surprisingly... All the traps went off. We only need to fix one doorway. Wow, we only need to fix one doorway. Is that what Bird Friend does? Does Bird Friend open all your doors and set off all your traps? I don't think so. Okay, we need to repair a doorway. So, we need boards. Trader Man has boards, so... <sighs> Actually, what I'll do... Rather than buy boards, I can save up. Uh, okay, I can save. Just get some gasoline. I'll chop the boards myself. And fill up the... And, and fill up the the generator a bit more while on the way. If you're curious, someone was showing off some cute art and being like, Hoo -hoo, look, it's cursed, Hoo -hoo -hoo, cringe. And I was just like, I don't know, this is cute. And it, wrong. Remember how uh, that, that stick bug meme was going around? At, at the pro... at the... At the peak of its popularity, that there was an anthro version drawn, and it, it would, she was cute. What can I say? The art was good, the character was cute, and it it was it was safe for work. So I don't know what they were complaining about. Just another just another asshole bitching about people's art. I was just like, I don't know, man. This is this is cute. Why you have, why why you being an asshole about it? I didn't say that. I was just like. They didn't call him out for being an asshole, but they were. I was just, I was just trying to spread positivity. I was just saying, hey, th this is this is cute. The art is good, etc., etc. And it's just like, Haha, fucking simp, fucking simping over a bug. I'm just like, okay, I will never be positive about about anything ever again, and we can all devolve into a stew of negativity. That's the world you want to live in. While I'm here, just spreading positivity. Just saying, hey, you stop dropping the shit, shithead! Anyway, I'm, here, I'm just trying to spread as much positivity as I can in this fucking festering hive of a world where people are just doing their best to cause issues for everyone else. And just be, generally be assholes and not nice and... And then, and then you do that, you say, hey, art, art is good, character cute, and then someone's like, I disagree with your opinion and will use my harsh word, and will use exclusively my harsh word to do so. I have no input, I have simply a word. That's... It's toxic. It's just, it's just toxic. But like, I don't know. Before I end the episode, I want to see if I can find the wolf. Maybe I have to go back to my first hideout. This doorway's broken too!
Fine, I'll buy some boards. what it takes to repair my shovel. Fine. I will buy some boards. Don't hit your ass with the door on the way out. Like I've said it a million times, I just don't get how people can be so negative. Like, it's... it's a curse. It really is. It's the curse we've wrought upon ourselves just to stew in this heinous miasma of negativity. Just all the time. That That's all we do. And I try, and I'm doing my best to break past that. I'm doing my best to, hopefully, just be be a positive influence. Just be just be a voice for positivity. Just say, hey, you can seek to under seek not to judge, rather to understand, etc. And I feel like I'm echoing into the void. That's what that kind of shit does to me, though. Like, and I know no one. Can. And I know none of these people that that are that that are just being like, <laughs> he likes the thing, <laughs> simp. I, I know none of those people fucking care. I know they don't care what they're doing. I know they don't care that they're spreading spreading negativity. It's just, it's just this mentality of, I th I think, therefore my thoughts mean more than anyone else's. I can't perceive their thoughts or their frame of reference, therefore it doesn't matter to me. You know, that kind of shit. I just think there's always room for more positivity, especially nowadays. It's so hard to come across just, just positivity in this world. And I, and if I can do my best to spread, as even just a little bit of positivity, then I feel like my life is worth it. You know. And sure, my positivity, my positivity will and has been met with. <laughs> Fucking simp, fucking furry, fucking degenerate, fucking piece of shit. I fucking hate you because of your opinions, and and my opinions are better than yours. It will, it, my, it will always be met with shit like that. There's nothing I can do about that. But you know, I ch I do my best. Well, if you here, dude. need to find the wolf. He didn't give me a place to meet him at. Dude, I got the twisted key. What more do you want from me? Like, it does seem like some- it does sometimes seem like what I'm doing is hopeless. Because, just, but I know the fact that 
the more negative the voice, the louder it screams. But it doesn't help with, you know, feeling like what I'm doing is actually making a difference. Which is why I'm glad I have you guys. Like, just getting to chat with you guys in the comments and stuff just makes me feel like, hey, I'm at least reaching a few people. And I'm happy about that. Still eating that body. You'd think there'd be no meat left. You'd think it'd just be a skeleton. But yeah. I just think it. What the fuck? I've gone on my long diatribes about negativity before, but I think it's important. That, that's just my thoughts on it. Where's the wolf? I think it really is worth it to just, like, attack negativity with positivity. That I always felt like that. I think it's worth it to say, hey, don't be so quick to judge. Seek more, seek... Seek to understand more than to attack. I, 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 at least I thought that would be just a simple concept to grasp, but no one wants to. And yeah, I know there are people who do want to. There, there's a lot of good people in this world, but it's just that the fact it's just the fact that the the negative voices are just so loud, and the positive voices kind of get drowned out sometimes. But we've got to be, we've got to be louder, but not, but not, uh, not as a, not abrasive. Because the negative voices are loud and they're abrasive. They get your attention. They, they make you hurt. They affect you longer than than a. Than, in fact, no, I take that back. One ne one negative comment will last as l a negative comment and a positive comment can last equally as long in someone's mind. It can a single positive comment can affect someone even more honestly than a single negative comment will. And yeah, those negative comments will probably fuel people like me to say, hey, seek to understand and love and, and be happy and not and not to judge and shit like that. Be good people. Love each other. Stop being stop being like, oh, I disagree Oh, I disagree with you with a positive so oh, I disagree with your negative comment. Oh, you disagree with my neg you you react positively to something that I don't like. Well, I attack you for for no reason because my opinion means more to me than your thoughts of me. I don't know, dude. It's not worth it. None of all this n none of all this heinous negative bullshit is worth it.
why seek to cause just hate? Why seek to proliferate negativity? I don't understand it. And, okay, tangenting real hard right now. You know what's something I've noticed? It's about pineapple. The, you can you can tell a, a person's mentality. At least, maybe, maybe you can tell a person's mentality by their by their thoughts on pineapple on pizza. Because I've never met goo. I don't think I've ever seen a single person who's who who dislikes pineapple on pizza, who hasn't, who isn't just absolutely 100% fuck pineapple on pizza and everyone who likes it, it's, and, and will... <laughs> and will do what they can to just attack, pe attack people who like it. It's a food. Opinions on food shouldn't be that heated. I don't know, dude. I think it's just... I think it really is just another instance of positivity being... having a... having a less loud voice than negativity. Because the people who will attack pineapple on pizza will be extremely loud about it. They will make sure you know that they think it's an affront to God, an abomination, and and anyone who likes it is Satan in disguise. But people who, but the people who like it are just like, you know, it's a, you know, you might not like it, but some people do, and and maybe you've had a bad experience with it because it is, because it can be good, it can be bad, and it, it's definitely a divisive pizza topping. But when it's good, it's good, and stuff like that, you know. Like the pe like the people who like it seek to be like, oh hey, I get I get that you don't like it, but uh, but try to be a bit more open minded and stuff. And the people who dislike it are like, fuck you, fuck pineapple, fuck pu fuck pineapple pizza, fuck everyone who likes it, and and just and just doing their best to spread just this anger towards a food. It's it genuinely is absurd. Okay, Wolfman, you you here? I hope so. Maybe I can get inside from a different way. Where the hell's Wolfman? Or, I need to break it. But seriously, is is it just me? Like, pineapple on pizza, IMHO, if it's good, it's good, if it's bad, it's bad. Like, it's like all pizza, you can, you can screw up pizza, so, like, pizza's one of, p pizza, pizza's easy to screw up. Especially when putting pineapple on it. Because, because pineapple, you know, I do not want to go in here. Pineapple's an interesting food. Like, like all other food, it needs to be done right, you know? I think it can be good. Like, if you do it right. That's just my thoughts. But I really don't understand being so hostile about, oh, you like a pizza topping that I don't? You are the Antichrist. Oh, you like a piece of art that I, d that I, th that I don't? You are a simp. 
oh, your opinions differ from mine? Well, you're just flat out factually wrong and are a piece of shit for trying to tell people other otherwise than my opinions. Negativity just continues to proliferate itself and, I don't know, dude, it's... It's all just... It's all just toxic. But I will do my best to cut through toxicity. What is this? It's a place with bad sounds. Oh, it's the hunter's cabin. Wonder if the hunter is in. I'd rather not find out. <sighs> and my thoughts are, as always, you're, you are 100% entitled to your opinions. You are 100%... You have the right to think how you think. You have the right to feel how you feel. But when you be an asshole about it, you forfeit that. When you start acting like your opinions are more, are more worthy to be held than anyone else's, you forfeit your you forfeit your right. Son of a bitch! You you it's you, you guys. You're the example of the of the, of the assholes I'm talking about. Cuz it's just it's just like, oh, he he wear a hat. He he we we and we and we don't like hat guy. How dare you wear hat? We're gonna chomp your ass. Where the fuck is the house? Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm screwed. Run time. This is one hell of a ridge. Think I'm think think. I think I pass it up. It might be down to the left a bit. This looks familiar. Yeah, it's down this way, I think. Yeah, chase me. I'm getting my ass home. Oh no. There it is. Take the stamina pill. I, I meant I meant to take the stamina pill. I didn't mean to take the fucking health pill. Okay. I don't know. This hideout doesn't have gas. This hideout doesn't have gas or flares. I only came here because it's not my only option. Oh, I have gas. Really, all I'm saying and all I've ever said is just be nice to people. Seek to understand. Stop just saying. Stop just using your. Stop just using hateful words to to, to consider yourself as better than other people. 
Use your words to make people feel better about themselves. To be pos to be a positive influ influence in people's lives. Whether or not they whether or not you like pineapple on pizza, whether you, if you if you dislike pineapple on pizza, cool. Just don't be an asshole to people who do, who do. That's all I'm saying. If you think someone making a cute anthro version of a meme is cursed, whatever. Just accept the fact that there there are some people who are like, "Oh, hey, this cute this cute version of a meme is actually cute." You know? I'm barking into the wind. People just don't care. And yeah, I'd want I'd want to do my best to help people be like, oh, hey, I never I never. People be like, oh hey, I never thought of it like that. I never thought that me me saying stuff like that could possibly actually hurt people's feelings. But y y trust me, you have a lot more credence in people's in, pe in people's feelings than you may than you may anticipate. One be like like Joker philosophy really does work. One bad day can can break a person but one good b b and one and one good day can oh no is a bird friend here friend here my lamp 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 don't stay in the way lamp I don't know what had happened if one of you broke Jesus 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 Bird friends, weird kids suck! Get off the menu, jackass! <sighs> Son of a bitch. Okay. okay. Whatever. This hideout sucks. Oh, like bird friend. Okay. Yeah, this is this is good old time honored fucking tradition of blight talking about being like, oh, be nice to people seek to understand and stuff like that I don't I don't understand negativity but it's one of the most prolific toxins in our world etc etc just being a motivational poster but it's important dude I, I genuinely believe it is like if the world's going to be if the world's going to attack you and the uh, and if you, if attacking back means spreading more pain then it's not worth it to attack back the same way that it's that it's attacking you. Attack back with positivity. Seek to help people understand. But people like people like people who just shit on who just 
just shit on people and attack people for whatever they for whatever harmless things that they in, that they enjoy just because their opinions differ they're not going to listen to this they're not go they're not they're not going to think hey maybe some hey I, I, I hurt people and they're and that's wrong that their their goal is to spread negativity whether they whether they believe whether they believe they are or not if you're attacking people whose opinions differ from you from yours your goal is to spread negativity your goal is to hurt people so as always my advice is just just seek to understand people that's 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 all I've ever said. Just seek to understand. If if you don't if you don't get something that someone likes, seek to understand why. Don't just attack people. That's the wrong way. That's that's the path to pain and suffering. And in fact, it's the path to causing you more pain and suffering. Like, if you don't want to deal, then don't deal with it. Put it out of your life. Don't attack it. Don't don't seek to understand it. Just put it in put it in the distance and say, I'm not gonna touch that. But it's it benefits you to seek to understand, because the less the more you understand, the less the less it affects you. If you understand something, it can't hurt you. Oh goodness. Anyway. Enough of me being a motivational poster for now. I don't know why I always devolve into this, but like I said, it's important, dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna head off. I need to, I need to finish up a thing or two. I need to get the morning stuff situated, and then I need to sleep. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the, the, just my thoughts as always. I don't know if this is as slowly as I'm supposed to be progressing. Because it seems like this is going so slowly, I, I just need to find the wolf. And and hopefully he'll lead me to progression, because I really want to progress. I'm liking the gameplay, but I want to progress. I want more story. I'm just running around the same places, gathering stuff, and and dying, getting my stuff back, and and then hopefully trying to survive the night, and then that's it. I don't want just episodes of me just, like, doing nothing but just playing the game, because I want to progress in this. Like, you know, I like the game, and it, and it's just like a fact of, you know, I, it's, in a game that is definitely leading you somewhere, I, th I think running, running around in a circle to the same places over and over and over again, isn't really leading to progression? I don't know. Maybe it'll maybe maybe this game takes its time and and certain events happen on certain days and I just have to wait for them. I don't know. I don't know much about this game. And I'm just continuing forward. I am enjoying it though, and I'm and I'm glad. I'm I'm glad this game has been recommended to me and I'm glad I'm getting better at it. But uh, yeah, bird friend Bird friend's not fun, especially especially here. In this hideout, I don't think it's possible to escape from bird friend. The the other in the other hideout, I at least did, I just didn't didn't need to worry about him. They were just over there doing screaming and doing whatever they wanted to. But you know, here it's just like, oh hey, have my angry little babies. And, uh, yeah, I've got some pasta in the fridge, and I'm going to probably put some balsamic vinegar and olive oil on that. Or red wine vinegar. We'll have to see when I get there. But, uh, yee! I hope, I hope you guys have been enjoying this series. I, I've been doing my best to get good at this game. It's just tough. It's a difficult game. And it's really punishing me for not being good at it. I just want to progress and see where the story leads me, <laughs> you know. All right. Well, if that's it, that's it for now. Tune in next time for for Blight g gives motivational speeches about meditation and attacking your anxiety and, and bettering yourself 
th through mental wellness and and cleansing your chakras and 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 connecting to universal essence and and all that hippie bullshit. <laughs> it, it, hippie bullshit or not, uh, I I genuinely believe that positivity is just one of the most powerful things in the world. Love, togetherness, and positivity. We need to. We need to. We need to. We need to help all. We need to help it. We need to help it cut through all of this miasma of just hate and and misinformation and and people just trying to forward their own agenda through just through ignorance and and just wretched treating people like lesser than them. You know. We need to. We need to do it for the for the for the for the future good of all of us. So I'm gonna stop talking about my hippie bullshit for now. I'll talk. I'll will see you guys in the in the in in the next episode. But it really is true. It's 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 just positive. I I, I keep I keep going in circles. <laughs> I'm fucking sleepy, you know. And when I get sleepy, I go in circles. Or may, or hell, maybe that's just how I am. I just go in circles, and that's my existence. But yeah, I love you guys. Have have a good night. Sleep well when you do.